Welcome back. Here's a look at some player reaction to Robert Sarver announcing his intentions to sell the Suns and the Mercury. LeBron tweeted, I'm proud to be a part of a league committed to progress. And Jamal Crawford tweeted, had to happen. Joining us now on NBA Today is senior writer for Anscape, Mark Spears. Mark, I know you have been speaking and communicating with players. What is the overwhelming reaction to Robert Sarver beginning this sale process? Well, the players have gone from shut up and dribble to speak out and dribble. And Malika, you were there with me in the NBA bubble where we saw a renaissance of where the players have decided to use their strength and numbers and their voice. As you see right here, you know, Chris Paul, LeBron James, and Draymond Green all have words that I think truly impacted what had what, what happened with Sarver. But let's give Tamika Tremelio some props, too. She's the Players Association's new executive director, and she speaks for the entire player membership. Uh, she doesn't speak unless they want her to. And she told me that, you know, there's no place in the NBA for Sarver, and she told you that she needed a ban. But uh, going back to the bubble, you know, it was the aftermath of George Floyd and Breonna Taylor's those police brutality deaths that brought the players there uh, wanting to push social justice. There was Black Lives Matter on the floor, uh, social justice terms on jerseys. And, and the Bucks, remember, they after Jacob Blake was shot by a police, they had a work stoppage for several days. That work stoppage, as you know, it sparked voting polling stations across the league. Uh, you know, the increased amount of coaches and black coaches and general managers have since been hired. The NBA has also been involved more uh, with black businesses, and they started the National Basketball Social Justice Coalition. So, you know, after the bubble, I was wondering if things were starting to wane with players, if there wasn't that much strength towards social justice anymore or using their voice to make change. But whether it was Draymond, Chris Paul, who— whose checks are signed by Robert Sarver, you know, LeBron James or the Players Union. Hey, they came strong with this, and I really think that had a major impact in Sarver deciding to move on. Certainly powerful player voices speaking up, and I think Zach Lowe rightly pointed out earlier in the show that the specificity that Chris Paul called for, that certainly made an impact in what we are seeing today. Mark Spears, as always, thank you so much for spending some time with us here on NBA Today. Thank you. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.